And this person was the governor in charge of everything in this very building. My family, this is the governor's living room. So, living room here, nine windows all around it, bedroom over there, five windows around it, main entrance, two windows, 16 windows, all around the area, and he lived up here all by himself. But the sad aspect of it all was that this was built on top of the men's dungeon with a church beside it. So then he lives here on top of the African men, but then the smell from there did not even come up here because of the fresh air. The noise never came up because the building has got about six feet thick walls all around it, plus the noise of the sea. So you'll be here enjoying everything comfortably and nothing down there will affect you in any way. So I brought you here to see the contrast. And then we will go down into the dungeons and see the other side of the coin. So please, let's come down, let's do the dungeons. And then it's going to be very emotional in the dungeon, so I will say that please let's guard up our lungs. <coughs> And give everybody a few minutes, uh, let them settle. Okay, so everyone, this building you see up here is now a children's library in Cape Coast Castle. But then you, should, you all should know that since the Europeans did not only come here to make money but also to spread the gospel, they had churches in all of the castles they built. So originally this building here was the first church of England ever built in this country. First church, of first church of England. The people that were in charge of it were called Society for the Propagation of the Gospel. Now look at something. Whenever they brought captives in the castle, some of them were branded SPG, which literally means Society for the Propagation of the Gospel, which means the church was involved in buying the captives. Yes. Yes. And right here, there is a hole here, which connects to the third chamber of the men's dungeon. People call it a spy hole, but know that this hole made it much easier for people down there to always hear the Europeans worshiping up yes. here. Yes. And the reason is that whenever they took them from the African continent to the Americas and to Europe, they were always looking to convert in Africans into becoming Christians. Say that one more time. It doesn't matter how much time. It doesn't matter how much time you explain that people still love being Christian. Yeah, they love being Christian. So, whenever they sent them from the continent of Africa to the Americas, they were always looking forward to converting people into becoming Christians. So, if I'm going to make someone become a Christian, I have to give them a good perception about my religion. 
That explains why I have my church seat built above the dungeon. You are down there, you always hear me singing hymns, praise and worship, preachers will preach sermons, parts that are funny, we giggle and laugh, you are down there, you hear everything. Mm -hmm. So psychologically, you think we are always happy worshiping our God. <laughs> but then as an African, you are in shackles and chains, you are in the dungeon, sleeping mm -hmm. beside your piss and poop and everything. Mm -hmm. You either belong to African traditional religion or Islamic religion, because prior to the Europeans coming, Arabs had been, they had done trans-Saharan slave trade. Yes. They, they did the same thing. They did the same thing. So, if you belong to that religion, you're in a dungeon, going through all of that, psychologically you're going to think that your religion is really horrible. And your gods have abandoned you. So then, when they start forcing their own on you, it becomes much easier for you to embrace it. So you realize they worked on Africans at every minute they got. Well, let's go down into the dungeons and see more from there. Please come. It's going to be a bunch of ride, so let's take it easy. So family, those are those disgusting graves that the white people have built Let me spin on here. So make sure you get a, a cup of urine and pour it on there. So we're coming back up here. I just wanted to highlight that.